what's up guys wise 24 here and today i have a cat 6 ethernet cable and a cat 8. i just want to see if uh, we're going to see different connection speeds based on the connection i have most of the time you're not going to use these unless you have like gigabit internet which i don't have here because it's not supported but we're going to go ahead and try and see if i can squeeze a little bit more of uh network speed out of my computer by using this one over this one so let's get into it guys all right guys so we're going to do a quick internet speed on my favorite one speedtest.net by okula but uh this is the cat six so let's go ahead and just let it fly now keep in mind guys i have 400 down and 25 up so we'll see if there's a big impact between the two wow there was a huge dip there for whatever reason i don't have anything else running besides you know captured capture device and stroud i almost said stream stuff uh you know i don't have anything else running other than the uh obs and this web browser all right so there you guys go there's that one i'm gonna switch the uh, cords over and then we'll try this test again and see if it matters all right so we got those cords switched out now your guys's miles may vary based on like what kind of router you have also internet speed obviously and your location because sometimes they like to throttle your speeds based on where you're at but you know so we're gonna have to i don't think we have to reset this i can I think I can just hit go. All right, let's see what happens, guys. 10 MS again. Woo! Wow. Okay. It might just be a fluke, but my God, that's like, what was that? A hundred down, a hundred more down. The upload's not probably not going to change. Yeah, I didn't think the upload was going to change, but I mean, that's a hundred more down. Now that might just be a fluke, but usually when I would retest it, it would be anywhere from like 10 to 20 difference, but not a hundred. That's almost 500 down. That's insane. Now I'm not, I'm not going to go ahead and say run out and buy a cat eight cable, but they're not that expensive. I got two of them off Amazon for uh, like $17 which I mean, if you're, if you're going to get more consistent speeds down, it might be worth it. Also, if you guys are still on cat five and not cat six, you probably want to go to at least cat six, but, um, yeah, that's going to be it for this video, guys. If you found this informative, uh, likes are always appreciated. Subscribe to the channel and I'll see you guys next time.